President Mohamed's address has sparked mixed reactions. Some have hailed the address as right on point, while others say it is a repetition of last year's presentation. Ah, the touch so on very salient issues. You know, his intro was fantastic, and the conclusion was excellent. And the issues that were rolled out by Bank of Ghana, they are not new. These are things that have been in the law books, but we haven't been following to, you know, uh, implement the rules and uh, those regulations. So, for me, it's not because he's my president, but he really, really did well. Well, I think uh, it was a mess back. Um, some of them were a rehash of what he said last year. Um, there are a lot of new issues that he has raised, and I'm looking at where to situate them, because they don't find expression in the budget. There are some critical matters that I was looking to hear, but unfortunately they didn't come up. Um, you remember the current issue afflicting our country is the state of the economy. The president opted to deal with other matters uh, that are important though. But of course, the economy now is the most critical matter. He pushed it further afield. And when he, he came to addressing them, we're looking for some bold measures that were going to be announced. Uh, no such things happened. Um, then on matters relating to corruption, which is uh, a canker, um, Again, we, no new measures were related to. The intention is good. Indeed, when the president was talking about the vision of Osajibu Dr. Kwame Nkrumah in focusing on increasing our manufacturing capacity, in focusing on replacing our imports with local production, I thought he was reading from the Convention People's Party manifesto. We have been saying that for many, many years. But the challenge is not with the vision. The challenge is with the how. How are we going to help our indigenous local entrepreneurs and producers leave or abandon the more profitable buying and selling activity and go into local production? In the final analysis, what we are happy about is that he, we are looking at how to change Ghana. And he said we, we need to change. We need a paradigm change in the way we do our things, instead of relying on imports, we have to do more to export. We have to, there's some, some subsidies that is going on already for what we see, but we, with the GCP, want more subsidies. Not what is uh, happening is not enough. We have to empower the Ghanaian more. <laughs>